This is probably the closest to pure collaboration Wilco has ever gotten. This is the record that needs to take the band to another level. Jesus don't cry. When we delivered the record that we didn't hear from him for like two weeks, you can we thought that was probably not a good thing. <laughs> They asked us to change the record. The band had felt like, that's the record, take it or leave it. They wanted to know if we wanted to leave. Well, I just think we've been jerked around so many times. Ryan's Wilco dropped. They uh, just say, we don't make money on this guy. I think to entertain any of their half-ass, fearful, frightened bullshit would be to compromise something that is a big part of my soul. Part of my heart. Word got out that the band were out of their deal. I had probably 30 record companies interested in signing him up. Are you Jeff? Yeah. Nice to meet you. I need a camera. It's not a VH1 behind the music story. It's not a drugs groupies celebrity kind of story at all. This band's story is the music. 20 years from now, they're probably going to get more of their due than they are now. When is the new album actually available to people who can go out and buy? That's a good question. <laughs> <laughs> Please welcome one of America's most exciting and innovative bands. Welcome! It all begins now.